Well, it's not something that we all want to talk about, but it's so very important having an end of life plan. Now these days you can plan it all so your family doesn't have to and there are lots and lots of options out there for you. Joining us this morning, Dan Salter with Dignity Memorial here to talk about all of our options. It's good to see you again, Dan. Thank you, it's good to be here. Well, let's talk about, well, you offer up a lot of different services there at Dignity. One of them is what you call cremation memorial memorialization. Now, we've all heard of creation, but what is, what is different about cremation these days? Well, there's not a lot. I think okay. there's a common misunderstanding that uh, cremation is a final process, and it's really not. It's only a part of the process. Mm -hmm. the, the services uh, or the memorialization surrounding cremation can be very much like that of a uh, traditional or casketed uh, burial. Right. Ceremony is the same, music, flowers, uh, tributes. Uh, so it's it's very much alike. You know, and I think a lot of people think when you think cremation is like, okay, we're done, so nothing can happen. But that that is not what you're saying, right? You absolutely can, not. You can even have a service before the cremation. So it's really kind of up to us, isn't it? It is. It is. You can have a service with the body present. Okay. Uh, you can view the body uh, prior to cremation, and then the cremation. Uh, actually take place after the service. Mm -hmm. Okay. I, I see, these are all things that we're not thinking about, right? Because this is not what we do for a living. It is what you do. And we don't want to talk about it. And, and you're right, but we need to. And that's why we we're do. starting the conversation today. So let's talk a little bit about planning because that is important. When we come into plan, what should we plan to do? How can, you, how can we better help you help us? Well, I think to have had a conversation prior to coming in mm -hmm. w would be helpful to talk about what you, you would want your service to look like. Okay. And sometimes you need help from family members to make those decisions, but certainly communicate that to family so that when that time comes, they'll know what to do. Right, right. But a lot of times, Dan, we don't know what our options are, and that's where you come in. That's correct. Uh, talk with a professional mm -hmm. who does this for a living mm -hmm. and can help you and guide you uh, along the way with the various options that you have. And I feel like after talking to you more and more that it's just it's just depending on what we want to do, right? It's, exactly. And, and the family, yes. of course. Yes, sure. So, and traditionally, when, when we also think of cremation, now you can have a service prior to that with the yes. body. Yes, yes. You can do the cremation, but then everybody thinks, okay, um, then what do I do with these ashes? We also have options with that as well. What are those options? That's a great point. Uh, there are lots of options uh, with cremation. There are niches. Uh, that can be a glass front niche where the cremated remains would be, or the ashes would be in an urn. Okay. And memorabilia, things that are important to the family, can be positioned within that niche for people to be able to see. Oh. You can have a stone front niche where it's more private mm -hmm. uh, and secure. Mm -hmm. You can make ground burial. You can put the, the ashes in a bench. Uh, you can Wow. You can bury the ashes in uh, the ground, okay. mausoleum entombment. The, the options are, are almost endless. Wow. Whatever your imagination. Wow, right, which again, why it's so important to talk to a professional who Absolutely. knows all of our options. Sure. Hey, Dan, thank you so much. Really My appreciate pleasure. the information. All right, if you'd like more information, you can also download a free planning guide because we mentioned it's so very important. All you have to do is visit this website, Dignity Memorial dot com slash details.